So what we've managed to resolve after a week of sort of just gently tinkering with this single prototype wing strapped to a bench, which looked like some freakish Frankenstein experiment, is a, a trigger that the performer can pull on and it opens this wing, which is made of six different components that are all interlocked. And then when they release the trigger, it folds back in and closes. That was the hardest bit. And it was sort of the bit that we, when we were getting the prototype puppets cut, we were like, there's no pressure. It's not gonna work the first time. I think we got to wing iteration four and we finally got it to work with all these different spaces and bits of aluminium. It looks deceptively simple when it works. We've been experimenting with a lot of different materials this time as well. So when we sent the first round off to the laser cutter, we had them come back a lot thicker than we ended up using. So the prototype was a really good chance to kind of test different widths and materials. We've ended up with a much lighter puppet than we probably anticipated, which the performers yeah. will hopefully thank us for. It's quite funny like how much time you can spend looking at a prototype that's not working and, and trying all these things to solve it and, it and it just refuses to work and then you know you step away for like 20 minutes a day whatever and come back and for some reason it's the puppets just settled <laughs> or maybe our brains have just settled and the mechanism works and it's like we didn't change anything <laughs> it's like is it gonna work again tomorrow but yeah we're all good so far